AVR, today's best country. I love doing the AVR Morning Show because uh, doing the AVR Morning Show, I get to talk to all the big stars, and one of the big Canadian country stars is Dean Brody. Good morning, sir. Good morning. All right, before we get started, I just took a look at your uh, picture on your uh, website. Has anyone ever confused you with Brad Paisley before? No, I'm not confused. Some will say that, that uh, we remind each other, of, you know, of each other or whatever because of the hat. I think it's the hat and the... I don't know. I, I really don't. Maybe it's our face kind of looks the same. <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I think you've got the same kind of look, I'm for sure. Okay. <laughs> but that's just me. Now, when you sing Roll That Barrel Out when you go into concert, you got to be getting some kind of reaction with the Deos at the beginning of that tune. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I mean, because people, they kind of remind them of... Uh, the Banana Boat song, right? It was, the song was kind of influenced by that song. So, yeah, people have been getting into it, man. We were surprised this summer when we were out playing and doing some live shows that people were just, they got really rowdy about that song. Now, you got a place on the South Shore. Uh, have you got a favorite place that you haven't seen yet in Nova Scotia? Uh, Cape Breton. I have not been to Cape Breton yet. And uh, it's because we live here, but I do so much traveling. Usually when I come home, I just I come to the South Shore here and I just recoup recuperate and and then head out again so eventually when i get like a two-week time time period off i want to take take off up to cape Breton. now you are married with children correct that's right yeah okay now when you're not touring what are you and your family doing uh we kind of we, we're real lazy actually we've got a uh, seven acres on the ocean and it's uh, an old cape cod i think it's like a 160 year old house and and we just sit out on the porch and barbecue and and uh just take it easy we're we actually we're very boring <laughs> you know what there's nothing wrong with that i mean you probably sit down and watch a nice dvd take it easy enjoy some family time then yeah we're into the mentalist right now have you seen that show oh yeah definitely i enjoy that show it's good man i love that we sit down and watch that and eat some junk food and and pretty much yeah all the excitement happens on the road once i get home i just chill out <laughs> now when you're sitting there with your family and you're tossing something on the barbecue what are you throwing on there dean chicken Oh, you're all about the chicken? I'm all about the chicken and the barbecue sauce. All right, now hold on. Are you doing the beer can chicken, or are you doing it chicken breast, chicken thighs and stuff? I'm just doing everything. Everything at once on uh, skewers, like kebabs. Oh, yeah? Yeah, we, uh, when we shot Roll That Barrel Out, we, um, one of the things that was really cool, like at night, the streets just come alive with people, like we were in the, in the back, back uh, road area of Puerto Rico, and uh, people just set up barbecues and started like, cooking kebabs and... and People started dancing in the street. It was the wildest thing. So ever since then, I just have a thing about having chicken kebabs with barbecue sauce and like a little piece of bread you toast on the barbecue at the same time. Mm. That's my thing. That sounds really good. Now, hockey season coming up. You're a boy from B.C. Who's your favorite team? Uh, Edmonton. Yeah, Edmonton Oilers were, was my team when I was a kid. And, and sadly, I don't know how we're going to do this year. <laughs> that was my next question. Is, <laughs> if you're going to be cheering for Edmonton, how do you think you're going to make out? Oh, uh, maybe I should. I might switch. I don't know. Maybe go to Vancouver. <laughs> so I'm from BC, so I could default there and be okay. Well, you would be okay, actually. Chad Brownlee uh, sings uh, "Sitting on the Hood of My Car." Yeah. Uh, was drafted by the Vancouver Canucks. Yeah. yeah, Chad's a great guy. He's, he's got a great voice, and we've hung out a bit this summer. He's uh, he's really cool. And yeah, Vancouver Canucks. That's awesome. Oh, so you're going to switch now, aren't you? No, I don't know. I'm pretty <laughs> loyal, so. Well, that's good because I've always been a Habs fan, and I'll tell you, we're going through a rebuilding year now. Oh, yeah. We had a good year last year. You might have another good one this year. No. Yeah, if we get fluky again, maybe. All right, you ready for the Fast and Furious 5, Dean? Okay, let me have it. All right, here we go. Favorite pizza topping? Cheese. All right, Nova Scotia or British Columbia? Oh, man, that's a, that's a political... I better, I better be careful I answer that question. <laughs> Favorite movie of all time? Gladiator. Facebook, Twitter, or text? Facebook. And the celebrity you most want to meet? Oh, man. You know, probably Kevin Costner. He's got his character uh, in Open Range. If you ever saw that Western movie, Open Range, it was, uh, it was just unbelievable. I'd like to meet him someday, I think. Well, you know what? With him singing with his band, you just might run into them at a honky-tonk somewhere. Yeah, that's true. That probably will happen, actually. <laughs> well, thanks for joining me today, Dean. I really appreciate it. All right, Jerry. Take it easy, man. APR, today's best country.